Now, Erie has been home to some great athletes over the years. They've competed in football, baseball, basketball, and Olympic sports. So let's not forget about arm wrestling. Two weeks ago, a man from Erie defeated his Russian opponent in what fans are calling the greatest arm wrestling match of all time. Our John Last talked to Erie's arm wrestling legend for this edition of The Last Word. Look at these pythons, brother. Actually, they're kind of pathetic. There's no way I could ever represent Erie in an arm wrestling competition. But that's okay. Erie already has one of the top arm wrestlers in the world. This is Dave Chafee working out in his garage. Dave went from competing at local taverns in 2006 to being a world champion in 2010. Two weeks ago, he won the King of the Table Super Heavyweight match in Dubai. Arm wrestling fans are calling it the greatest match of all time. I've been on ESPN a few times. I've, I've been overseas like 11 or 12 times now to compete. It's just, I'm truly lucky to be able to do the stuff I, I do. I never, ever thought in a million years I'd be where I am now. Dave took on another arm wrestling legend in Dubai the Russian bear Vitaly Lalatin, also a former world champion. He's 6'7", 300 pounds. We can see the focus and determination of this giant. Dave won the first two rounds of the best of seven match. And gets the pin. Dave Chafee. But Lalatin came back to win the next three. The announcers on the worldwide pay-per-view were questioning Dave's chances of a victory. But then came the grueling round six. Both competitors were already spent. I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm, I'm so tired. And I'm th this is going through my head. I'm thinking, I have nothing left. I'm, I'm thinking to myself, my eight-year-old son might be able to beat me right now. The camera close-up showed the intensity of the competitors in round six. Dave's hand was bleeding from having it slammed onto the table in an earlier round. He also strained his abdomen and had trouble breathing. Arm wrestling matches are usually over quickly. Round six was a marathon. He's got, who will take it round number six? It is an absolute bloodbath. Who's going to have the courage to stay with this longer? Both guys. And it's Dave, Dave, Dave was exhausted before round six, but he was fired up before round seven. And I'm looking at him and I'm seeing, he, I'm tired, but he's more tired than me. I got this. I and mean, you, you just go for it. Dave won the king of the table. Soon after, his friends urged him to read the online reviews, calling it the greatest match of all time. Hundreds of people, thousands of people saying that when, you know, you realize you've been involved in something special. It's pretty cool. With the last word in Dave's garage, John Last, Erie News Now. Go. I was waiting for that. I'm speechless. Wow. Dave works as a correction officer at the Erie County Prison. He may go unrecognized on the streets of Erie, but he is a star in many European countries that closely follow arm wrestling. And by the way, Dave says he is still recovering from the match with the Russian. His opponent fared much worse. He was taken to the hospital after the match for treatment of exhaustion. Dave, congratulations.